All right, guys, right in front of you. That's the train station. And it will show you the timings for departure to uh, Mecca. Let's find out the tickets. How much is the ticket to uh, Mecca from here? So it's leaving. The next one leaving at 8.59. No, I'm sorry. Uh, 8.05. Platform 4. And okay, let's find out. So you can buy your tickets over here with no banknotes, no coins. No credit cards, no banknotes. Uh, let's see what's going on over here. So guys, the moral of the story is this, that I'm right here in front of this uh, Herman train station and uh, there's nobody at the ticket counter. The automatic ticket sales over here, uh, they'll self explanatory But the tragedy is this, that it's six o'clock in the morning and the next train does not leave until 8.05. 8 uh, it's two hours, that's a long wait. I'm not sure if I wanna do that or not. Um, I have to go and pray, the Fajr prayer, and then I uh, come out uh, from the masjid and see if I still have the time uh, for uh, you know making the decision. Because I'm, I'm now leaning towards the bus because uh, bus is cheaper over here at the last minute if you want to buy it it's 90 real and let's check out the bus how much the bus is so I'll keep you guys posted so guys uh, after the Fajr prayer now I'm gonna go downstairs to find out the bus services but once you come out of this escalator in the arrival lounge uh, you can take the taxis you know taxis are right over here you can see the sign taxis and uh, there are a lot of guys over here basically trying to sell their services for regular taxis. Be very careful. All right, shuttle buses and buses. You see that? Right over here. So guys, I just found out that uh, there is a free bus service to Makkah. Uh, let's check it out, what's the procedure? And uh, if, you know, they allow me to get on, I'll, you know, I'll show you guys the procedure. Uh, but let's find out uh, if it's for only the hajis or the pilgrims or the visitors. I heard it was for the visitors, but let's check it out. There are two sides. Uh, so over there, you have to pay. On this side, I was told that's where the regular bus is for the, you know, Makkah. So let's find out. All right, guys, so I just found out that um, even though if you are coming from the United States or Canada and stuff, um, back in the days, you have to apply for a um, Saudi visa. It would give you a big paper with your picture and everything. Uh, those, you know, those type of visas still get the free bus show, you know, service. I got the visa on arrival for Umrah. I do not qualify for that. So anyway, uh, I'm going to go and check out the other bus services and let you guys know. All right. Uh, so this visa, you know, if you have a visa paper, with a picture on it, uh, you can go through here and they offer you free bus service to Mecca from Jeddah airport. Uh, not for those people who are here, you know, for getting the visa on arrival. So, okay, let's check it out the other side. All right, guys, so I finally got my ticket. It cost me 92 real. Uh, if you buy it from them at the counter, it was 103 real. But you see those uh, kiosks over there? It cost me 92. But the gentleman at the counter told me if you guys are traveling or planning to come to um, Saudi Arabia, just download the Herman train app. It will be a lot cheaper. So if I would have bought it online, it would have cost me only 80, some, you know, 85 or 86 real. So I paid five or six dollar uh, real extra for a service charge using that kiosk. But I would have paid uh, 20 reals extra uh, if I would have, you know, buy from the ticket counter. Uh, if you buy it online and you buy it uh, in advance, the price is much cheaper. Uh, I bought it on the day, uh, so it cost me 92 real. Anyway, uh, you have to come in and then you have to go through this uh, right there. You see that guys? Uh, over there, that's where you uh, scan your boarding pass. It's just like an uh, airline thing. 
you go through the security and all that and uh, you get onto the train. Keep you guys posted. Guys, so you just press this. And the gate opens up. It reads the QR code. And uh, there's a security line over here. I guess they're not using it today. But you can see it's getting really famous now. A lot of people are using it because of the high speed. You are in Makkah within 45 minutes. And so if you want to go to Medina, that's where people are going. That's pretty <coughs> busy over there. I'm going to Makkah. There's a <coughs> sign over here. You can take the Makkah. And that's so right now. It's almost seven in the morning, about an hour to go. That's a beautiful train station right inside the airport terminal. And you guys can see those are the high speed trains waiting out there. I was surprised they do not have 24 hour service, but let me find out just want to make sure. Alright guys, one more update about this Herman high speed train from uh, Jeddah airport to Makkah. Uh, this train does not run 24 hours. Uh, if you're coming back to the airport from Mecca, the last train leaves at 10 o'clock or 10.30, depending on the day. Uh, these nice, nice ladies over here, uh, they told me, uh, they're standing right here to help you guys out. Uh, uh, just be, uh, just want to let you know, guys, uh, English is not their first language, so give them some break. And they're progressing and they're learning, so I'm really proud of them. And uh, they're trying their best to help you guys out. And, uh, and I'll keep you guys posted. Talk to you guys soon. All right, guys, the, uh, my train has been called. And uh, now we are going that way in the platform. Um, it's going to leave from platform number four. Uh, still got 25 minutes to go. Uh, I'll keep you guys posted how the process was, how the train is and everything. My coach number is 10 and my re seat number is 295. So check it out. So this is the train station, you know, the platforms over here, guys. Uh, I think they have platform one, two, number, I think number six, one to six. And that is the train. Pretty impressive, nice and uh, very modern open-air platforms. Majority of the people who are going to Mecca, they are the pilgrims. Some pilgrims uh, first go to Medina, pay their respect to Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and then come to Mecca. Uh, last time I did the same thing, I went to Medina first, then came to Mecca. Uh, this time around, uh, I'm going to Mecca and then gonna go to Medina, inshallah. Uh, beautiful train. Uh, you can see that's a little dirty right now because of the desert climate, all the sand and everything. But it's very modern. So that's the coach number 12 over here, guys. Mine is coach number 10. So just follow, once you buy the ticket, it will give you all the information on your ticket. So that's coach number 11 right over here. So I guess mine is number 10, it's next, next to it. So let's go and check it out inside. So this is coach number 10 guys, right inside. I'm coming in, that's a pretty decent bathroom and nice and clean. And nice area for for your luggage you can put your luggage here and uh, I'll get my seat keep you guys supposed to let me put my luggage up so my luggage is here right now Pleasant trip. it's starting to move guys We're going to jet the first stop
guys we have arrived at Makkah train station here in Saudi Arabia